so welcome to my channel and to today's day in the life video as you saw we were just having a pretty easy morning with some pancakes Nico and I are headed to go get his haircut that is something on our list to get done and then I have a bunch of other stuff to do it is a Sunday uh, so it's my day off work kids day off school as well as we have family coming in town later this week that are going to be staying with us for a while and so we have lots of prep work to do yesterday we decided to clean out a bunch of stuff like closets and donate a whole bunch of stuff and so i still have a few things to do lots of laundry um, my daughter's room we are getting her a new nightstand and dresser but also that's for the guests that are coming because her room is going to be kind of the guest room and so we need to put that stuff together so lots of stuff to do a busy day so i hope you guys enjoy this day in the life video so nico got his hair cut and he got purple and he got a lollipop how was your haircut appointment Good. Good? Yeah. Nico and I just got home from his haircut. I'm making the kids some quick lunch, just some pasta noodles with butter and cheese. Um, I'm going to do a Walmart order because I need a bunch of food items, kids snacks, juices, um, some like bathroom stuff. And so I'm going to do that now as well. Hopefully that gets here today. All right. So the kids had lunch. They want to go play outside. Um, my husband has some stuff he's doing out front. He needs to trim some trees, fix some of the Halloween decorations. Um, and so I'm going to bring the kids out there and I figured it'd be a good time to make some coffee. And so today's video is sponsored by Javi Coffee. They sent me this coffee concentrate that I'm going to try and make into like a blended coffee drink. Um, so it's concentrate. So this is 30 servings, this little jar. And so you use one to two teaspoons, um, start with one teaspoon per six ounces of liquid. So I'm basically gonna fill this up with ice, some milk, and then some of this and some caramel and blend it together. like this um, I would just go get one at like a coffee shop but I'm excited if this works out so let's try it out so good so I used one and like a fourth teaspoon of the concentrate and I can taste the coffee but it's not too strong so if you like a strong coffee you could probably do two teaspoons but this is absolutely delicious and I think do you refrigerate this so you can refrigerate this for six weeks so this would be good too like if you're going on a trip or vacation because how easy would this be to pack it's little they also have different flavors so down below I'm going to give you guys a discount code link make sure you use my link to check out Javi coffee I'm definitely going to be buying more of these and they are shelf stable before you open them so these would even be good to just stock up in your pantry and have on hand and they make really good drinks And this is what I need. Because if you can hear my kids screaming upstairs, they need to get outside and play. So I'm gonna go drink this outside while they're playing. And I'm hoping my daughter's dresser and nightstand gets delivered um, so I can build that and get her room done. I have laundry going, the Walmart order's coming later. I did decide on the Walmart order to just get like, um, like, uh, household products like uh, the, our laundry stuff we needed some bathroom stuff 
some like paper plates and stuff, but, and some snacks, like snack packs for the kids, but I'm gonna do a food grocery pickup order tomorrow. So, um, yeah, so we're gonna go play outside for a little bit and then we'll get to some more. So this is so good, I'm so excited. All right, so while we were outside, all of our Amazon stuff came, and so um, I'm just getting my son a snack, and then him and I are gonna head up upstairs, and I'm gonna start building um, some of the dresser and the end table for my daughter's room, switch some laundry around, all of that stuff. The dresser and the nightstand I got, I actually got the, sim the same brand, but it was like different colors from my middle daughter, and they're actually really good because they're affordable, but they're like part wood, part fabric basket. And so I really like them because they're easy to put together, they're affordable, they look good. And so I'll link those down below if you guys are interested. All right, so I, I'm out of breath because I carried these boxes up to my daughter's room. Um, so her room is where we're gonna have our guest staying because she has a queen size bed and then she has like a pull out twin bed underneath. And so um, it's, my husband's cousin that's staying with us, but actually she was my old coworker like 15 years ago. Her and I were friends and we worked together and um, I met my husband through her. So anyway, so we basically call her our kids' aunts and then she had kids right around the same time we had kids. And so her and her two daughters are coming to stay with us. And so um, they'll have this room while they're here. And my daughter needed a nightstand and a dresser anyways, and so it just kind of made sense to get it all done this weekend. Oh, I'm so out of breath. All right, so this is the nightstand, and so just simple two drawers. They're, they're fabric drawers, but they have like real handles and a real wood top, and so they're just a little bit, I don't know, I like them because they're light, they're easy for me to put together, they look cute. And so see, this is like the fabric drawer, but then the front is like this wood plastic. It's just such a cool thing. Like it's obviously cheap. Like it's not, I don't think meant to last years and years and years and years, but I mean, they're pretty good quality. And so that's like the wood front of the drawer. And then you just put these on. It's so cute. All right. And then the frame is like metal. I have put together a lot of furniture, especially Ikea stuff, which is a nightmare to put together. This is nowhere near difficult. This is super easy to put together. Um, but yeah, I can do these pretty quickly, even though my husband always offers to make build it. I'll get it done faster if I do it. Um, and he has enough projects that he has to work on, so. This is simple enough for me to take on and do. So my husband has all these like cool tool sets and stuff and I've had this one screwdriver for like 13 years. Um, and my husband always tries to throw it away and I'm like, that is my screwdriver. Do not touch it. Cause it fits in everything. It just works. Like he always tells me like to get different sizes or whatever. This screwdriver just fits and works and everything. Like kids toys, like all of that. And so, um, I don't know, maybe I'm crazy, but this is my screwdriver and that I put together so much furniture in this house with just fine. All right, so this is the nightstand, it is done. So it has a wood top, this like fake wood front, but then they're fabric drawers with handles. And that is it, this took me less than 15 minutes to put together. The dresser is much bigger, so I'm anticipating it's gonna be a little bit more difficult, but I absolutely love this. So this one is $40, um, and then the dresser was like under $100, uh, but I'll link them down below. All right, so we're done with the dresser. It is smaller than we thought it was going to be, um, but same concept. It's just was a little bit harder to put together just because obviously there's more parts because there's different size drawers, but pretty easy. I mean, I think, what time is it? It's 3 o'clock, so... I don't know, maybe an hour for both is what it put together. So we're gonna get her room rearranged, put together. We're not going to, I have like new sheets, new pillows, pillowcases, 
Um, we're probably going to do all of that the day they get here because my daughter is actually going to sleep downstairs on the couch. Um, so I won't kick her out of her room before then. But then, yeah, I have new sheets um, to get this room all ready. I have our Walmart, one Walmart order coming later today. And I'm probably going to need to do two more grocery chip trips this week. I'm trying to think what else are we doing today it's three o'clock is that what i said yeah. it's three o'clock i have laundry the girls have laundry nico is, just nico is gonna be playing with play-doh um we have to get dinner made i don't know yeah so um so far pretty productive um so we're gonna i'm gonna help her get these moved and situated in her room and then move on to some other stuff that we need to do. All right, so uh, my daughter and I decided to just rearrange her room and that took forever and so I'm exhausted. It's 4.30, I need to get dinner at least started. I am making some homemade breadsticks and spaghetti, so not too bad of a part of a dinner, but the dough for the breadsticks needs to rise and so I mix that, it's doing its first rise right now. Um, so yeah, that'll be good, then we'll have leftovers tomorrow. Um, so I'm gonna need to clean up all the stuff behind me. I am going to make my sourdough starter. So my kids don't like sourdough bread, which is why I really never cared to do it. I love sourdough. so. I think I'm gonna at least get my starter started. And so I'm gonna do that um, now and put it in a jar in whatever direction. So we'll see if you guys have your favorite sourdough discard recipes because from what I've, I guess I'm having a hard time understanding like how are people making like pancakes and muffins and cookies out of sourdough because it's like more savory than sweet. So I guess that's what I need to understand and learn. Um, but I'm gonna get started because I know it can take, you know, up to two weeks to ferment, especially because it's colder right now. And so um, I'm gonna work on that. This is rising. Spaghetti will be super easy. And um, because we redid my daughter's room, that took a lot of my time. She's finishing putting some stuff away. I'm gonna try to get some laundry done and clean up, but I'm tired. It's been been a long day all right so the starter recipe I'm using is from the Cle the clever carrot I had really good reviews and so it's a half a cup of whole wheat flour and a fourth cup of water and so I have this it says not to use organic but this is what I have that's whole wheat flour and so we're just gonna take a chance which probably isn't the best thing since I've never done this before but we're gonna use what we have and it's only a half a cup um, so we can always redo it if there's an issue. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. will sing about your heart Maybe the trees will whisper the word Maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope Alright, and that's it. And then I'm just going to let it rest and follow the instructions. Alright, we just got our Walmart order. Um, we got some of these just mini alphabet cookies. I figured the kids would like these. Some Pokemon graham cracker snacks. Um, we got some like lotion, some body wash, shampoo and conditioner, just to stock like the guest bathroom with stuff for guests. Plastic spoons, glossers, some toothbrushes, toothpaste, more little Scooby snacks. Watch out guys. And then some bleach for laundry some deodorant, some face wash. This is more body wash, a two pack. 
some paper bowls, two things of juice boxes, so two 32 packs, so 64 juice boxes, and then a pack of baked chips. There was some that is coming on a second delivery, so I'm not too sure, but this is part of the order. Oh, and bleach. I don't know if I said bleach for laundry. Oh, <laughs> but um, so this is a part of the first order. There's some more laundry stuff coming, some more snacks coming, and then we're gonna do a grocery pickup order from like Smith's, which is like the Kroger brand, and then maybe a Trader Joe's haul to just get some like good stuff for like dinners and snacks. And so we're gonna put this away. I'm gonna finish dinner and I'm exhausted. And so I'm gonna wrap up this day in the life video. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me today. Have a wonderful day and we will chat soon. Bye guys.